Health Break is brought to you by Dignity Health Central Coast. The reasons to undergo spine surgery range from severe injury, infection, tumor removal to chronic pain. To treat these patients, Dr. Alan Edelman at Marion Regional Medical Center says they are performing minimally invasive image-guided spine surgery. Minimally invasive means the emphasis is not necessarily on the length of the incision, but how the tissue, especially the muscle on the inside, is handled. The less dissection of the muscle, the less pain someone's going to have, particularly in the short term after surgery. Very clearly, people recover faster from operations done in this way because there's much less injury to the muscles. When you add the computer guided imaging systems that we have available at Marion, it adds incredible safety and allows you to do procedures in a way that no one could even envision before these systems were available. The majority of people who have spine surgery do it to relieve chronic pain, oftentimes sciatic pain. And for some people, the back pain will improve, particularly if they have structural problems that the surgery can correct. Depending on their underlying age and medical problems, there really aren't very many restrictions. In fact, we get people up walking the next day after surgery and strongly encourage people to pursue regular exercise programs on their own once they're done with formal physical therapy. Most people actually do quite well. For more information, visit DignityHealth.org slash Central Coast. For Health Break, I'm Kristen Presall. Health Break was brought to you by Dignity Health Central Coast.